All right, welcome back to Sycamore. Starting right where we left off here on uh, Textile Row. What's she filing her nails? Oh, she's sharpening the scissors. Not sure exactly what she's doing. Maybe she was just shearing a sheep. Anyway, uh, it's time to build the keep, I think. That's what I want to do. Let me turn on the user interface. That's control U, which I did with one hand. And uh, two people passing by, one decided to join. We have a decent number of unemployed. One of these, how about Leon? You're going to be a builder because we could use more of them. And Adamant, you're going to be a builder. Okay. And let's get this keep built. So I'm going to take advantage of the fact that I can build the keep off the property. So let's go to monuments and let's go wooden keep. And look at all these different parts. The barracks and everything. I'm going to put it right here. And I'm going to put it off the property line, taking out some trees. I think that's one of the highest spots. It's not the high. This is the highest spot, though. All right, I changed my mind. I'm going to put it over here. And then I'm going to put not the super fancy, but a decently fancy top on there. Good overview right here. And then I'm going to want to put some barracks in. And uh, can I put the barracks right here and have them look good? Not really. It gets kind of in the way of that window, doesn't it? I'll make it taller, though. You don't want to snap. Can you snap? You can snap right in the middle. And if I build it that tall, it hides those windows, and that looks good. So that's the barracks. And then uh, doors. Ooh, I forgot to... Where the heck is the door? Is the door on this side? All right, let me get some steps in. Where's my steps? Perfect. The door is on that side. Lucked out there. And... That's enough for now, except I'm going to need training dummies. And where am I going to put the training dummies? And you might cut down trees too. Mightn't you? So let's put a training dummy here. And another training dummy, and yeah, this is facing, I can't see where I put the other one. Let's put another training dummy here. Um, yeah. And another training dummy. Sorry. No, I got rid of it accidentally, put it back there. And another training dummy. Yeah. How about here? And another one. Here, I think. We'll do four to start off with. And uh, definitely put some flags in. I put a flag on top, yep. And uh, put some banners on. Uh, these are the hanging banners. We'll do one, two, three. We need cloth for these, but we're making plenty of cloth now. How much cloth do I have? Did I turn this off? Uh, three cloth. Okay, well... We are making cloth, though. Shouldn't be a problem. That's my story. Right there. And right here. And then more banners. Banners all over the place because banners are new. So we need all of them. Okay, and do I need a door for the barracks? I don't know. The barracks doesn't really have a door. We have these extra parts, too. I'm going to build those right now. We have a small door that I can put... Right there. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. All right. Right there. First keep. Yep. Why can't I start construction? Upfront cost 700. There's an upfront cost. Oh, no. <laughs> well, we're not too far away. I had no idea there was an upfront cost. We're almost there, though. Hover over it. We only need 780. And look at that. There we go. Start construction. Because the clothing is making us a ton. Look at the 111 income from the village. The clothing is making us a ton of cash. And that's a good thing. Let's, let's actually hover over this. And how much cash have you made me? Uh, 10 for 100. Okay, not a ton of cash, but it is extra cash. And we've had some more houses move in. 
I'm gonna not allow upgrades on you either, just because, you know, beach property. Right? And how are the fish doing? 206 fish. Good grief. And how are the sales of fish doing? 35 fish sold for 350 gold versus the berries. 15 berries, 135 gold. So the berries are going up because I think they're choosing fish over berries. Nobody decided to join the village. Why? Why? I don't know. But anyway, Cerbratac and Marjorie, you're gone. And this sawmill starts up now. We're going to put one, two, three in. And we did get Marjorie and Cerbatac. And we also got Blissed. All right. So that's good. I'm not happy with this whole... I'm not... I'm not happy with the fact that we're kind of planting trees in amongst the houses. Why am I not happy? I don't know. Just because I've never done it before? I'm going to keep it like that and see if I like it. But anyway, I want to put in another lumber camp. We have two unemployed. Ayuet and Orangi. I'm going to put in another lumber camp. Lumber, 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 lumber. We have 47 lumber. And this lumber camp's sole job... You're going right here. You're actually going to go sideways right here. Your sole job is to take out... And I can't really control what you do, but I'm hoping you're going to do this. I want you to take out all the trees up here. You can leave these. And then I also want you to take out the trees on the rocks here. I don't know if you can reach these or not. And let's take out the trees here as well. And we'll see. And really, all these trees. We don't need any of these trees. I can replant them. That's the beauty of it. Take out all these trees for now. And the same with over here. We're taking out all the trees where the where the keep is. I keep wanting to call it a fort. There. And I'll leave these three for now. And it's raining lightly. Whoops. Okay. But uh, we need that to get finished. And then let's take a look at here. Rustic Church additional parts. I've already unlocked those. I need 20 Splendor and 20 Commoners. How many Commoners do we have so far? We have 10. I need 10 more Commoners. Nobody's joining because we have unemployed. Which is kind of good. Is all the planks taken out of here? They are? Okay, you're gone. Yep. Let's delete that. And let's expand the residential area now uh, into... It's already here. So they should already maybe try to build. Maybe. I think that's a perfect spot for a new house. Once somebody joins. Alright. So as far as jobs go... You've got 30... Ah, somebody just took them, but that's a sure sign that we do need somebody extra here. Uh, wow, we're really filling up. We are really, really filling up. Okay, hold on. Trading. 20 common clothes. Ta-da! You buy bread, tools, and weapons. You'll sell fish. So that's not going to solve us of our fishy problem. Uh, 222 fish. We just need to sell more fish, and we're definitely selling enough berries. Oh, who sell? Who buys? Anybody buy clothing? No, you buy clothing for 10, which is good, but I need to unlock bread. Or I need to start bread for that. Nah, not quite ready. Alright. Three lakh space. A new house is going up right here. There's more space for housing. We have 700. We could start expanding. I'm going to go ahead. Let's expand in this direction. What am I doing? Let's expand in this. Where do we want to expand? Let's expand in more water here. Let's expand in this direction. And let's go ahead and paint some more residential areas over in here. Right? We'll, we'll keep it kind of away from the berries there. Like so. But... Here comes the horseman. You can expand all over in here for now. That should be plenty of space. Plenty of space. You can go all the way out here for now. Alright, I'm going to keep you off the coast. For reasons. But that'll... You can leave me alone for a while. There's plenty of space. An envoy wants to talk. 
You want fish. We've got fish. We'll assist the people again. Go ahead and do that. Good. We've got some cash right there. And let's promote all. And then who else do we want to promote here? Uh, let's see. We've only got 14 planks. Hmm. Hmm. That's interesting. Uh, didn't I assign another builder? You see a builder in here? Forager, market tender, woodcutter, stonemason, carpenter, forager, forager. I was doing the carpenters. <laughs> uh, I almost did a carpenter song there, and then I thought better of it. And I'm glad I did. Uh, the woodcutters, I don't want you slowing down. The forester, oh yeah, the forester can definitely slow down. Man, that dude's planting trees way too fast. Uh, stonemason, no, not the stonemasons. Not the market tenders. Our fishermen, why don't we? Because uh, they're fishing like crazy. And where's the other fisherman? There he is. I wish this was ordered by job. Or something. Either by job or by name. Or give me, give me a choice to order. Alright, how many do we have now? We have 15 commoners. And if I can get that to 20, we can have some more unlocks. Foragers, okay, foragers potentially I can update. They won't go past commoners, but we've got a bunch of these, so let me update these to commoners. We're going to fill up the church, of course. You know what you're doing here, right? There we go. So I have 20? I have 20. We're going to stop right there. We're stopping right there. And houses are starting to upgrade. Cool. This house is going to upgrade to one of the nice looking houses. And is the church full? Yes, it's full. Full, so let me add on to it. Mm, let's see. We've got some additional parts. This gets me 10. This gets me 10. Let's put one of these on the back. Right? It's already taller. And those windows, I think, are fine. That gets me 10. That looks good. And let's put some goofy parts on the back, too. Like these wooden parts. If I put you, like, right there, and then on this side, didn't you have a window on one side? You did. Let's put you over here. Because these are fives, right? Oh, these are tens as well. Ooh, that's good. Okay, good. By the way, they're not walking in the door correctly. You see that how they're kind of doing something weird there? I'm, I'm not going to worry about it. But, um, yeah, okay. Let's start construction. That'll expand the church. Uh, building complete lumber camp. Uh, let's assign our woodcutters here. One, two, three. Which includes Egdifu, Barbadarius, and Orang. All right. And you're going to get cutting up here. How's the keep doing, by the way? Not quite finished yet. And, uh... You've managed to put the dummies up without cutting down the trees. That's a very woodsy keep, isn't it? Good grief. Okay. It looks kind of cool in here. But not exactly the look I'm going for. So we'll let them get to cutting down those trees. Hopefully they don't come here and cut down this stuff. But you never know. You never know. And we do have a number of houses building out in this new area now. Good. And uh, so hopefully, uh, next round of immigration, we'll get some more immigrants in here. Ooh, and you're actually going to the next fishing spot. How about that? Uh, this must be overfished, because you're going out here. How about that? Good. All right. Houses are getting complete. And now we are uh, waiting for uh, more people to join our village. All right, we're rolling right along. We have, uh, what do we have, five unemployed now. And uh, we wanted to... We've got two here. We're, we're almost, we're full of fish. We're full of fish. They're not selling the fish fast enough. 44 fish. Good grief. Good grief. I need to slow them down. Uh, the church is still building. The keep is not quite finished yet. I think the biggest problem there... And uh, I slowed it down for a minute. I'm going to speed it back up. They are they are uh, taking the trees off this hillside, though. 
and it looks like they can get to these areas as well. But the biggest problem with uh, the city right now is the keep is using a lot of planks, but yet it's not a problem. I think it's just the number of builders. So as I, as we gained more and more villagers, I forgot that I needed to bump the uh, number of uh, builders up. So one of these, hey, left Quinn. Mm, I want to save males for the soldiers since the soldiers can get hurt. I'm going to go all medieval and uh, stick to male soldiers. But how about... How about we have some UB builders? One more builder there. Two and one. We did get a four and three. That's the best that we've gotten so far. But uh, as far as immigration goes, hey, it's the end of the month already. Uh, oh, I missed some of these people. Barbadarius, Egdafu, Lefquin, Andreas, Thora, Cecil, and Anna. Uh, promote all. Check out the money, though. We're just rolling in cash right now, mainly due to the clothing. And then, uh, oops, uh, let's keep this. What do you want? You want bread. Of course you want bread. I'm, I, we've got fish everywhere and you want bread. Uh, the commoners just make so much money. I'm really tempted. Ooh, I can, why can I, oh, of course I can, I have my first potential upgrade to citizen because I can, and I'm going to do this, I think. Because they've got an upgraded house. They probably live in this upgraded house, right? No. I'm not sure. I know they, they've they gotten their two pieces of food. Right? Because we have two different foods. And... I can't really click. Can I click on you? Can I click on you? I can click on you here. Yeah, you've... Uh, you're short... You, you don't like the fact that you don't have upgraded housing. That's a red. But you've got two pieces of two different foods, and you've got your clothes. So that apparently is enough to upgrade you to a citizen. And then you're going to want luxury goods. I'm not going to promote yet. Um, we're going to promote any more builders that I have here. Here's two more into commoners to make us some more cash. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop right there. Enough promotions for now. Tell them to leave me alone. Okay. So how's this keep doing? And what are we waiting on? We are actually waiting on the 40 cloth. Okay, I can fix that because remember, I only put one uh, weaver in here. So let's have Andres be our second weaver. And we're sitting on 31 wool, uh, zero textiles or cloth, and 50 uh, common clothes. So the second weaver should help that situation out. Building's now complete rustic church. Really wish you were using the front door. Very tempted. If I rebuild the front door, will everybody get kicked out? Uh, 33 of 65. Okay. That's good. We just won't watch. And we have our first house upgrade. Look at that. Look at that. Where's the front door in this house? That side? It's a good spot for it. Yep. First house upgrade right there. Not sure why this was chosen, but there you go. I think only commoners can upgrade, too. I have to say, I'm not totally sure on what allows housing to upgrade. I think you have to be a commoner in order for your house to upgrade. But is that true? Snecty? You are a serf, so no, I'm wrong. And Ring War, you're a commoner. Ooh, one commoner, one serf. What does it mean? What does it mean? I don't know. Uh, speaking of which, uh, I only have one well in the village so far. It might be nice if I had more than one well. Especially since we're building way out in here. So, I'm gonna put another well in right here. Uh, let's just put it at this intersection right here. There we go. And, I could put another market in here. Since we know everybody's gonna go to their house. And the housing's gonna build out in here. Why don't I build a couple more markets out here too. Uh, and let's build both of our food markets because I need to sell food. I've got too much of it. And we'll, we'll put one right there. And only one food market per monument. Otherwise, they line up and they go in order. Uh-oh, Zero decided to join. They go in order. So, for instance, if I put a berry and a fish, fish would only sell if the berries were sold out. 
and that's not what I want. So instead, I'll build two separate mon market monuments, and that'll solve that problem. And let's do another market. Our house is upgrading. Good. Another food stall. And the first one's right there. Well, I like the way. I couldn't see it, but you can... When you get close to it, see how it... That is really cool. I didn't notice that. That is really cool. Look at that. All right. So I want to build it uh, actually right over here, I guess. Yeah, another food stall. The other fish food stall's right there, though. But... Somebody put their house right on top of the well. Oh, that's the one that's upgrading. All right, hold on. My bad. Destroy it. Okay. Well, I'll redo the well after this house finishes upgrading. What what kind of upgrade is this? Oh, this is a density upgrade. Yeah, those density upgrades are nothing but trouble. All right. I'll have to redo this. We're going to put another market in here. Where am I going to do the well? We'll put the well over here now. And then I'll have to think about where to put the other market. Is this keep done yet? How are we doing for the cloth? We still need... Oh, we only need 10 cloth now. 11 cloth. Okay, and that market was complete quick. Real quick. So, notice also how I am absolutely refusing to see how close people live. I'm just not doing it. Hey, building, build a wooden keep. The kingdom has noticed your keep and might call on you to aid in the military campaign. I shall think about training soldiers eventually. Um, got all kind of stuff open here. Already? All right. All right. What, how many unemployed do I have? I'm going to, I'm going to take it just because I don't have to send them yet. And then uh, you're going to sell fish, by the way, because we have too many of them. We can sell berries, but we can't sell fish. Thora, you're going to be selling fish. All right. And uh, I want soldiers to train. So let's assign some soldiers first. Uh, we, we need to cut down these oaks. Look at all the wall banners. Uh, who do we have here um, as far as villagers go? Male, female, female, male, female, female. Hmm. Four and four are coming in. Perfect. Okay. So, who did I say? You're... Okay, so what I need to do is I need to click this, and I need to find... Yeah, you're a male. You're in. Novus? Yep. And then we wanted to do Brickeen, right? Yeah, Brickeen, whatever your name is. You're in, okay. Then we go to this and we say, hey man, we have five swords. So you guys take your swords and train. And you're already partly trained, okay. But you're not going to go out on a mission yet. Or maybe you are and you die horribly. You know, whatever. But um, I'm going to try to wait till I have five. Uh, I'm sitting on 900 cash, so you know what? I'm going to buy some more land. I'm going to buy this land here. And... Are you guys... Are you guys actually cutting these down? I hope. I think you are. We have 44 wood. I could actually put more woodcutters up in there. Uh, oh, who do we have? Olive... Sure, I'm gonna get all. This reminds me of ah, boot live at Budokan here, is a male, and uh, yep, yep, live at Budokan. So you you can become a soldier. That reference uh, will will be lost on many people, but um, right, you're in, and uh, then we go to the army manager and say you get to hold one of the swords too and go up here and train now I was gonna say I could build another woodcutters camp up in here to get these things moved out faster another lumber camp and then uh, once they're done I'll remove it and we'll take out that tree while we're at it or uh, let's just put it right up here alongside the road 
Okay. I need to put a wall in. I don't like them walking up there. I want them to walk up the middle, so I need to put a wall in as well. Let's go ahead and high parties. Leon is bringing five tools. That's good. Four and three again. Have I gotten a four and four? I don't think so. Uh, now we're down on wool. Down on wool. Let's put... Oh, man. We're moving right along now. Let's promote all the serfs. And then... Do I want any more commoners? Uh, how about a builder? And... Two are still unemployed. I'm surprised we're getting so many. These are long-term unemployed. That's all I'm going to do. Yeah. I'm just going to make sure we have commoners in here. And uh, I'm waiting for them new villagers to come in. There they are. Uh, Bricken. Causantin. And Beetle Lou. <laughs> so Bricken and Causantin, you're going to be uh, soldiers. I don't want to get too attached to you for reasons. Bricken and Causantin. There you go. And do I have enough weapons? I don't want to click on that. I actually want to click on this menu. And you get a sword. And you get a sword. And now I'm going to wait till you're trained up. Uh, I'm always requesting an audience. What do you want? Fish. Oh, yes. We can definitely hand out some fish. So what are we looking at here? We have 20 commoners. I need some more splendor. We have 15.45 splendor from that one church. Dang, man. How much splendor do I need? And then I can unlock that small stone wall, which I'd kind of like to use. We can go ahead and unlock the wooden wall and the large stone wall. And we can also unlock the hunter's hut and the decorative parts of the wooden keep. But we can't unlock the weaponsmith yet, but that would be nice. Uh, yeah, but then I need to create... Because I'd, I'd love to create my own weapons. But then I need to unlock iron. Which, on this map, means I have to string out the property over to the nearest iron mine. Or build a bridge across the way. Which is probably maybe less. So we have 7, 2, and 21. We're all out of kingdom. We have 7 clergy, which is enough to unlock the church. And then the monastery, I'm not ready for yet anyway. So let's do it for the kingdom. I'll assist the king. All right. Ta da! And, oops, I paused. There he goes. And I guess I'm going to want to build the bread farms out in here. This is where I picture the bread farms going. Out along there. Do I want to put... How many planks do I have? 150? I'm going to put a wooden bridge in. Hmm? Because iron is right up here. And that would mean if I wanted to buy land, I'd have to buy this. And I think one more gets me the iron. It could be two more. But it's a heck of a lot better than going this way and having to go, I think, the nearest iron... Here's the nearest iron here, which is one, two, three. Well, it's kind of the same distance, isn't it? Oh, but why not build a wooden bridge? Let's go ahead and build a wooden bridge. And a wooden bridge. And where do we want it? Where's our roads? We're going to have to build a road through here, so that's what I'm going to do. Uh, let's see, this road comes up here. Let's let's do it right here. And when you build this, see how you get that, that red do not enter thing? That's That was added a few versions ago, but you want to make sure that uh, you don't have those on either side. And you're far enough up the bank. You don't have to be that far up the bank in this version, but let's go ahead and do that. So there's a wooden bridge over to the other side. And then if I did want to... By territory, yes. This one's ready to go. And then this one. That's right in the middle of that territory. Okay. Uh, I need 570 planks. I don't have them. Uh, we can make them. Let's start. There. That's going to put our planks to zero for a while and put a dent in our funds. But that's alright. Uh, how are we doing here? You have 48 planks here because what? Is our warehouse full? Yeah, the closest plank warehouse is over here. And you've only got 50 of them. Ah. 
Let's add another uh, Indricot. Wait a minute. No, we. I can't afford any more soldiers right now anyway. I have to win. So, let's do this. Let's do this. Our soldiers are either partly trained or mostly trained. They're ready to go. Here's the mission list. Uh, easy, distance far. Um, let's assign all of them. Cross your fingers that we see these people again. Success probability is extreme. If you say so, send them out. There they go. And uh, they'll regroup near the uh, original center of town, which, frankly, I should build a well over. And uh, there they go. Off they go. To wherever it is that they go. And we'll have to see if that works. In the meantime, uh, I am going to build a well over the city center now that uh, now that we don't. Uh, I've already built the Lord Manor, so that's where the horse goes. The only reason I don't build a well over the city center at the beginning is because the horse will come right over the, into the well, and I don't like the way it looks. That's a, it's a very shallow reason, but that's that's the reason. And now nobody's coming in, so. That's probably because we have uh, a bunch of unemployed. So let's employ these people. Oh, I built a stonemason hut and I didn't put anybody in it. Gee, I wonder why our pile of stone production didn't go up. How many people have been yelling at me for that? Okay, now, now we have three. I forget when I built that. Now we have three. That should increase our pile of stone sales. And how is the clothing sales doing? Yep. Well, only five. It looks like we just flipped over, right? No, we're in week three. Day three. Okay, because this is weekly tally. Yeah, the clothing sales are good. I did want to build another sheep farm, I think, because it looks like that's the holdup right now. So let's build one more and see how that goes. So sheep farm. We'll put you kind of right behind this one. Kind of in the same direction here. Back a little bit. There we go. Build that. And the berries, 264. We're not worried about food yet. Mainly because we have so many fish. But eventually that'll be a concern. This finished. So let's assign three here. I dead, Mungo, and Florententia. And uh, Wicketu, Biddaloo, Olive, Tiffiana. Yep. And I need more splendor. What was I saying? To get that stone wall, I need 20 splendor. The church is... How's the church doing? The church is almost full. I need... How many splendor do I need? I have 15.45. So basically, I need 5 splendor. 5 splendor. So what, what kind of parts do we have here? What gives me some splendor? This gives me 0 0.5, 0 0.5, 1.5. Oh, the grave doesn't give me any splendor. Go figure. 1.5 for the big stone extension. 2 for these. Another core. All right, this is going to be this is going to be a big church. Too far. Relax. I want you I want you moved in though, so I'm going to have to force the issue. So let's turn off uh, T to turn off snapping. And I'm going to put you right in there. I can't. All right, what is it? So to get the to get the biggest reward, you have to continue the quest to keep the troops troops with you. And so here you see that there's a 100% chance of a rare reward if I do this, 80% chance of a weapon. Keep my troops with you. And uh, the success probability is average. We're probably going to have some injuries. But there you go. Keep them with you. Now, before I was so rudely interrupted. There we go. And it's, that's higher than the other side. Probably because it's a different piece. But anyway, that's plus 4.1. And then I need just a little bit more. So... Let's put on, on the back here, let's hide another one of these pieces. Oops, turn snapping back on, please. 
And where do I want to hide it? Let's hide it over here. There we go. And that's 4.3. Oh, is this really low? That's plus 0.5. Really? Let's put another one on. There's plus 0.5. Or plus 5. Uh, let's put you over here. Because that window's too close to the ground anyway. No, here. Snap. You don't want to snap there? Fine. Turn off snapping. Put you right in there. There you go. Okay. Plus five. Start construction. That'll get us the amount of splendor that we need. And we're still waiting to see what happens with the troops. So, you know, it dawned on me here that, uh, hey, the bell rings. Thank you, bell. And uh, it's the end of the month. So let's promote all. And do we want any more commoners? Mm, we have a lot of unemployed. Uh, now, if I change one of these to, let's say we make... Your soldiers are victorious. We are victorious. Still, there's that last battle. Charge. There's the unique reward. 80% chance. Success probability very low. Charge. What do we have to lose? I don't even remember their names. Uh, let's let's make some of these unemployed. Like, uh, Amable is Amable to becoming a builder. And uh, where was Amable in the list? There. Let's uh, upgrade you to a commoner. And Ioko, sure, you can be a builder. And unfortunately, you just got promoted, so that was silly. Uh, who is Lefquin has been here a while. So Lefquin, you're going to be a builder. And uh, building complete well, good. And then Lefquin, we're going to pay to have you upgraded to a commoner, good. Make us even more money. And there we have two different upgrades right next to each other. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, right, I need to add on to this. I've got to have a room to do research. Yeah, this one will be for research. There we go. Doesn't look too bad. Maybe one higher. Why spend all the wood though? Right, there, start construction. Okay. And let's high prioritize this, otherwise all the wood goes to the bridge, which is slowly being finished, but our planks are down to zero because, right, we need a lot. I could build another sawmill. I really could. Uh, you can also see that we're just about done cutting down trees up here. How about that? Quest failed. Send soldiers to help King. Our soldiers were defeated. I lost every single one of them. They're gone. They're dead. Wow. Well, I guess maybe <laughs> that's, uh, do, do we, do we, oh boy. I trained him in everything. Man, that's tough. That's tough. Hey, who wants to be a soldier? Uh, off the beaten path there in Gilpatrick there. And, uh, who else? I think that's it. Just the males. So off the beaten path and Gilpatrick. Uh, let's see. Beaten and Gilpatrick. There you go. And you know what? Did I lose my weapons? Your soldiers. And maybe I got the weapons back. I did get the swords back, so that's good. It was nice of them to at least bring back the swords. Okay. <laughs> that's lost. And here I was. Well... The the uh, the Lord Man will be finished by the time that uh, I need it. Um, and hey, let's assign an available Tiffiana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. New sheep for you, and uh, that should solve some of the wool problems. Man, and I think I th I don't think I need these guys anymore. I think you've cut down everything I wanted you to cut down. Okay, you're going down here and still cutting this down. Okay, and then. I will tear down that lumber camp because we don't need it anymore. Or you'll just come down here and do this. But really, I'm going to need another sawmill. So we'll have the whole four and four building complete Lord Manor. Oh, minus six. How? Why are we negative? Why are we suddenly negative? Well, anyway, uh, we need more uh, plank because we're not selling planks for one thing. We need another sawmill. And we could do this, the whole sawmill, just the whole woodworking complex 
can be right across the street from the clothing complex. All right, so let's put you in right here. There you go. And because uh, we need more planks. Definitely need more planks. And why I'm negative five all of a sudden? I have no idea. Uh, we have 88 clothing. Uh, are people just upset because uh, we lost some of our soldiers? We have plenty of food. Huh. Let's take out this well. Yep, there we go. And then we got the, only the main well, which is good. And there we go. Now we're back to plus nine. That's what we'd like to see. I mean, we're sitting on 700 cash, so it's not like we're in dire straits or anything like that. But, yeah. So I will make one of these, this new part, I will make it a study room. There. And a, I'm not going to assign a scholar until we need one. We'll just keep that open. Alright. And then I do have this whole area. See, see how these people are building out here? So I built this market. And it's kind of sideways here. But it's working. Thor is working it. And I guess I could put a fish market in here too. How about I put a fish market right over here? Market. Market food. Yeah, because we have a house building here and a house building here. I think this is fairly safe. Let's put one right here and we'll go ahead and put a red tent on it because I haven't been doing that. But we should have the cloth. Well, six of them anyway. Start construction. And that'll be for fish. Good, our funds are going up. So right when those soldiers got wiped out, boy, we hit the big negative there. I don't know what that was. Um... But, ooh, four and four. All right, now I'm getting nervous. A lot of people are coming in. I still have a lot of food, but... Uh, yeah, that's, that's a lot of mouths to feed. I'm still bummed that the quest failed. Uh, okay, any more? Ebota, the Deuce, Ganilda, Melcenta, Goldvive, Wikitu. Look at all the females. Just like, just like when you get a monastery and you only need males. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm being that way. I'm only doing males to the uh, keep. That's just a decision. Typical medieval times, right? Right? Keep up on the hill with uh, our two soldiers training. All right, we got more people. Who do we get? Forbesak. Oh, yeah. And Libby does my uh, Forbasak show up on the list please yes at the bottom of the list but nevertheless there you go soldier that's three I need two more and uh, who do I have new people aren't here yet and I didn't catch to see how many people were joining but anyway we've got that built I'm gonna go ahead and how are we doing here we're still not cutting down a lot of trees you're working on the bridge out in the middle of the sand there I'm going to go ahead and move you. I'm going to build another lumber camp down below. Alright, since these are negatives, might as well build them down here. Let's build another one right here. And then I'll move everybody from there down to here. Alright. And I still have a lot of things I can build here. Um, uh, the wheat farm, of course, is obviously next. That brings on the bad weather. But we can do the uh, the cheese makers, the dairy farm, and the cheese makers. We can do the iron, which is probably one thing I want to do. Uh, two more people coming in. I want this bridge to finish first. We're about ready to get the lone horseman of the apocalypse here. What do you want? Fish. I'm all about fish. What do we need? Mm, this isn't finished yet. Man, that's not finished yet. But we have plenty of that. We have 12 kingdom. We're going to need just three. And then we can open up trade bonuses if we want. Clergy is the same way. The trade bonus is down here. And if we have enough splendor, this is already good. The first trading village is labor. So that's what I'm going to want to do the bonus for here. Which is uh, somewhere in here. The trade bonus here, yeah. But we're going to need 20 Splendor and we only have 12. So I'm going to have to put tents on a bunch of stuff. But let's do labor again. That's my that's my thinking. 
Uh, I'll assist the people. There you go. All right, let's decorate up our uh, our markets so we can get some more splendor in here. And uh, you get the red. Good. And now, what do I have any extra unlocks? Uh, we don't have 20 splendor yet. We have 16. Whew. Need more markets. We have one more that's gonna finish. But there now, what, what does that give us? That gives us 20, it gives us 18 and I need 20. All right, no problem. No problem. Let's edit this one and let's put up a little fence decoration here. So we'll just put in a fence over here. And how much are each of these? 0.5? Yeah, just a little fence. Right there, move this one over. Kind of like this. There's the fence. And maybe put some barrels. That's 0.5. Maybe put some barrels over here. Right there. And maybe a bench to sit down on. Uh, let's put the bench actually over on the other side. There's a bench right here. Oops. There we go. Let's start. And they actually build it this time. Instead of just being instantly done. That should give us enough splendor to do the next unlock. If we were looking out one of the keep windows, this is the view that we would get down to the burgeoning village of Sycamore. And this rustic church is not complete yet, mainly because we're not making enough planks. So when we come back, I need to remember to assign people to that new sawmill, uh, tear down that old lumber camp, and work on all kind of things to get us going. Also, I would really like to get the iron mining in and start making our own weapons so I can really ramp up the number of soldiers we have because I'd like to win that first mission, which so far we have not won. We failed. Five villagers go out, zero come back. Oh well. All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later.